Have you ever stopped to think about what makes people notice you before you even say a word? Why do our eyes, often called the windows to the soul, seem to tell their own stories? And how do the vibes we give off connect with the world around us in a special way? Welcome to our journey here on Wisdom in Real Life on YouTube, where we dive into these fascinating topics. We're going to explore how our body language, the true way we express ourselves, and the unique energy we each carry play a big part in drawing others' attention. We'll blend ancient Buddhist insights with the things we all go through every day to show you why sometimes people just can't seem to look away from you. It's about more than just how we look or the things we say. It's about the deep, real part of us and how we vibe with everything around us. Imagine walking into a room and feeling like you belong there, not because of how you're dressed or what you're planning to say, but because of something invisible and powerful you bring with you. That's the kind of stuff we're talking about. It's like having a secret superpower that makes people naturally want to be around you, listen to you, and see what you're all about. And guess what? This isn't just for a few special people. This is something we can all tap into once we understand how it works. On our channel, Wisdom in Real Life, we're all about breaking down these big ideas into fun, easy to understand insights that you can use in your everyday life. We're going to look at why your smile can light up a room, how your calmness can make people feel safe, and even why just being yourself is the most interesting thing you can do. We'll show you how the teachings of Buddha and the wisdom of centuries can help us live better today, how to be more present, more compassionate, and more authentically ourselves. And here's the thing. We believe that everyone has something special about them. Sometimes, we just need a little help seeing it in ourselves and bringing it out for others to see too. So, whether you're someone who feels like you blend into the background or you're already comfortable standing out, there's something here for you. We're going to uncover why people might be drawn to you, often without even knowing why, and how you can use that to create more meaningful connections in your life. So, if you're curious to find out more, stick with us until the end of this video. We promise you'll walk away with a new perspective on how you interact with the world and the people in it. And who knows, you might just discover something about yourself that you never knew before. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to Wisdom in Real Life for more content that helps you navigate the journey of life with a bit more wisdom and a lot more fun. Let's dive in together and uncover the secrets of what makes you irresistibly you. 1. The Light of Compassion and Vibrant Energy In this beautiful journey of life, have you ever noticed how some people just glow with a kind of warmth that draws you in? Imagine someone whose simple presence feels like a warm, comforting hug on a tough day. This warmth is all about compassion, a silent, powerful force that speaks directly to the heart without needing words. It's like when someone smiles at you, not just a regular smile, but one that lights up their eyes and makes you feel seen, understood, and valued. This isn't about doing big things. It's about being real, being there, and sharing a kind of kindness that touches people deep inside. Now, let's think about those special folks who buzz with an energy that's both soothing and exciting. They have a spark, a zest for life that's contagious. They're the ones who remind us to cherish each moment, showing us how to find joy in the little things that we often overlook when we're caught up in the hustle and bustle. Their vibe isn't loud or flashy. It's inviting, encouraging us to pause, breathe, and appreciate the wonder that surrounds us every day. But how do people become like this? It starts with simple, everyday actions, offering a genuine smile, truly listening when someone talks, understanding without judging. These acts might seem small, but they're the building blocks of compassion. They're about seeing the world with a heart full of love and kindness, even when it seems hidden. These special people act as mirrors, reflecting the best parts of us, especially the bits we've overlooked or forgotten. 
Their way of being gently reminds us of our own ability to be kind, loving, and truly alive. Being this source of light and energy isn't about making grand gestures or being perfect. It's found in the little choices we make every day, to be real, to listen well, to speak kindly, and to act with a big heart. It's realizing that how we are with others can brighten their day, making a difference in ways we might not even realize. This is where the wisdom of Buddha's teachings on compassion and living in the moment comes in. These teachings give us a path to follow, a way to enrich not just our own lives, but also the lives of everyone around us. It's about embracing the journey of being mindful, of finding happiness in connecting with others, and discovering the vibrant energy that comes from an open heart. So, as we go about our days, let's remember the impact we can have, the strength of a caring heart, and how our actions can create waves of positivity. Let's choose to be a beacon of compassion and vibrant energy, making the world a little brighter for everyone we meet. By doing so, we don't just change the world around us, we also grow ourselves, finding deeper happiness, purpose, and connection in the beautiful tapestry of life. 2. The Intrigue of Uniqueness Have you ever met someone who just stands out, even without trying? There's something about people who are truly themselves, those who don't just blend into the crowd, that catches our eye and hearts. It's as if they have a story to tell, not with words, but just by being who they are. This isn't just about looking different or having a unique style. It's deeper than that. It's about their thoughts, dreams, and the way they see the world, which is entirely their own. When someone is genuinely themselves, it feels like a breath of fresh air. They show us it's okay to have our own quirks, to think differently, and to follow our own paths. They light up the world with their uniqueness, showing us the beauty in being different and the strength in living true to ourselves. They don't need to say or do anything special to challenge the usual ways. They just do by simply being themselves. This makes us think about our own lives, whether we're really living our truth or just going along with everyone else. These unique people often have a special way of expressing themselves that grabs our attention. Maybe it's the way they dress, the art they make, or the ideas they talk about. This isn't for show. It's a peek into their inner world, a way they share what's in their hearts and minds. They keep us guessing what they'll do next, making every moment with them a little adventure, a chance to see the world in a new light. What's really cool about them is their quiet confidence. They're not loud or boastful. They just have this calm, steady vibe that says, they're okay with who they are. This kind of realness draws people in. It creates a space where others feel free to be their true selves too. By embracing what makes them unique, these people mirror back to us our own chance to be truly ourselves. They remind us that the world has a place for every one of us, for every unique story and dream, no matter how unusual it may seem. They teach us that we don't need to fit a certain mold to find our place or to be loved just as we are. Walking your own path, being different, isn't always easy. It takes guts to step away from the crowd and live by your own rules. But the rewards? They're huge. You get to connect more deeply with yourself, and you attract folks who love you for the real you, leading to friendships and relationships that are deep and meaningful. So, let's give a shout out to those who dare to be different, who inspire us to embrace our own unique selves. Let's be encouraged by them to discover and show off what makes us, well, us. By doing this, we don't just make our own lives richer. We add color and variety to the whole world around us. And if this is making sense to you, don't forget to like and subscribe to our Wisdom in Real Life channel. 3. The Complexity of Human Emotions Exploring our feelings is like stepping into a world full of different colors. Each color tells a story, shows a feeling, and helps us understand more about ourselves and each other. Let's talk about some of these feelings, like when we meet someone who just seems to stand out, and we can't quite figure out why we feel a bit nervous or shy around them. It's not that they're trying to scare us, but there's something about them that's just so… big. And it makes us feel a mix of respect and a tiny bit of fear. 
Then there's jealousy, a tricky feeling we've all felt at some point. It's not the nicest feeling, but it's natural. When we're jealous, it's like looking into a mirror that shows us what we really want or value. Instead of letting jealousy make us feel bad, we can see it as a clue, a little nudge telling us what's important to us and maybe what we'd like to have or be too. It's about turning that feeling into a push to do better for ourselves. Our body speaks a whole language without saying a word. The way we stand, look at someone, or even the energy we bring into a room says so much. This silent chat we have through our actions and expressions can say a lot about how we feel and what we're thinking. It's pretty amazing how a simple thing like a real smile can show someone we're genuinely happy to see them. In every chat we have, it's not just the words that matter, but also how we say them and how we show we're listening. Understanding the silent messages we send and receive can help us connect better with others. It shows we care and understand, even without words. Empathy is like a bridge that lets us walk over to where someone else is standing, to see the world from their side. It helps us feel what they're feeling and understand them better. When we're feeling a bit jealous or intimidated, empathy can help us see that. Deep down, we're all not so different. We all have dreams, fears, and feelings that can bring us closer together. Understanding our feelings and the silent ways we share them isn't just about knowing ourselves better. It's about making our connections with others stronger and deeper. Every look, every gesture, and every unspoken word is a thread that ties us closer, making the story of us richer and more colorful. So, as we journey through our feelings and learn to speak this silent language, let's remember the power of empathy and the silent conversations we have. By doing so, we don't just make our own lives better, we also make our connections with those around us more meaningful, creating a beautiful picture of togetherness that's as complex and wonderful as the feelings that inspire it. 4. The Language of Silence In our busy world, silence has its own special language. It's like a hidden way of talking without words, telling stories and sharing feelings in a quiet but powerful way. When we stop talking and start listening to this silence, we can understand each other in ways we never thought possible. Our body language is a big part of this silent world. A smile, a nod, or the way we stand can say so much about us. These small actions show how we're feeling and what we're thinking without us having to say a single word. It's amazing how a simple smile can make someone feel welcome and understood, all without speaking. Eye contact is another silent talker. When we look someone in the eye, it's like saying, I see you and I'm here with you. It's a way to show we're paying attention and that we care. In a world where it's easy to get distracted, taking a moment to really see someone can make all the difference. Our movements and gestures are also part of this quiet conversation. A pat on the back, a gentle touch, or just being close can make people feel supported and loved. These actions might seem small, but they have a big impact, making us feel connected and valued. Silence itself can be powerful in a chat. It's not just a break in the noise, it's a space to think and feel. When we share a quiet moment with someone, it can make our connection deeper and more meaningful. It shows we're comfortable together, even without words. This silent way of connecting isn't fixed. It changes and grows. It asks us to be fully there, to notice and listen in a deeper way. It's about tuning into the little things, the unspoken messages, and the feelings that are too big for words. Learning to understand and use this silent language can really change our relationships. It helps us feel more together, building trust, and making room for real, heart-to-heart -heart conversations. By noticing the silent messages we send and receive, we can create a space where everyone feels heard and understood. When we share silence with someone, it's like saying, I'm really with you. These quiet times can be just as important as long talks. They remind us that being there for each other, even in silence, is a beautiful way to connect. Silence invites us to really listen, not just to words, 
but to everything else someone is sharing. It's a chance to hear what's behind the words, the real emotions and thoughts that sometimes get hidden. This silent language is something we all understand, no matter where we're from. It's a reminder that deep down, we're all looking for the same things, to be seen, to be heard, and to feel connected. By opening up to this quiet way of communicating, we can find deeper, more meaningful ways to be together. Using silence in our everyday life encourages use to slow down, be present, and connect with others on a deeper level. It shows us that the strongest connections often come from the quiet moments, the shared looks, and the comforting presence we give each other. In the world of silence, we find a special kind of conversation that speaks straight to the heart. And if this is making sense to you, don't forget to like and subscribe to our Wisdom in Real Life channel. 5. The Magnetism of Mind and Spirit In the journey of life, there's something really special about the way some people just naturally draw others towards them. It's not about what they look like or what they have. It's something you can feel, like a warm glow. This kind of attraction comes from the mind and the spirit, and it's about the invisible ties that bind us together, making everything a bit more lively and fun. First up, let's talk about curiosity. When someone's really interested in learning new things, exploring ideas, and just asking questions about everything, it's super inviting. This excitement for discovery shines through in how they talk, what they do, and how they interact with everyone. It's as if they're saying, hey, let's go on an adventure. And honestly, who wouldn't want to tag along? Then there's passion. When someone really loves what they're doing, maybe it's their job, a hobby, or a dream they're chasing. It lights up their whole being. This kind of enthusiasm is catching. It makes everyone around feel more alive and excited about their own stuff too. It's a reminder that loving what we do can make our own world brighter and touch everyone we meet. Having a deep connection to something bigger, like a spiritual path, adds another layer. People who are deeply connected in this way have a calm and depth about them that's really intriguing. They walk through life with a peace and purpose that makes you wonder, what's their secret? Inner peace, too, is like a magnet. In our busy, sometimes chaotic world, someone who is calm and content really stands out. They show a quiet strength that draws people in, reminding us that it's possible to find calm inside, no matter what's happening outside. Being fully present, really in the moment, also pulls people closer. When you're genuinely listening and fully there with someone, it makes them feel important and heard. This gift of being present is rare and precious, and it forges strong, real connections. The path of personal growth is captivating as well. People who are always trying to understand themselves better, to learn and grow, inspire us. They show that change is always possible, that we can always evolve and be better than we were. Knowing why we're here and moving towards our goals with focus and energy attracts others. Seeing someone clear about their purpose and committed to it, even when it's tough, is truly inspiring. Being open to new experiences and ideas is another part of this magnetism. When we're open-minded and ready to explore, to see the world in new ways, it invites others to share their views too, enriching everyone's understanding. Connecting deeply with others really seeing and understanding them at a soul level is powerful. It creates deep and lasting bonds, a feeling of being truly seen and understood. And sharing our journey, the things we've learned, and how we've grown, not only deepens our connections, but also offers hope and inspiration. It's like saying, we're in this together. All these things together create a kind of magic around a person, a force that draws others in. It's about being curious, engaged with life, and finding joy in the journey, and then sharing that joy with others. This kind of attraction is about inspiring people, about creating a space where everyone feels a bit more connected and the world seems a bit brighter. 
By embracing our minds and spirits in this way, we not only make our own lives richer, but also add a little more light to everyone around us. 6. The Theater of Daily Life Life is like a big, lively show, and every day is a scene filled with its own little stories. Imagine life as a play where every moment, from the simple to the special, adds up to make our days interesting and full of surprises. Have you ever just sat and watched people go about their day? Maybe while sitting on a bench or in a coffee shop? It's like watching a silent movie. Everyone has their own story, their own worries and happy moments. It's a gentle reminder that we're all part of something much bigger, each of us playing our own part in this huge story of life. Then there's the magic in everyday things, the way morning light sneaks through the window or how the hustle and bustle of people starting their day has its own rhythm. These ordinary bits of life are actually full of beauty, just waiting for us to notice. Our lives are woven together through all the hellos, chats, and even the silent moments we share with others. Watching and being a part of these moments is like being in a live show, seeing how we all connect and share bits of our lives with each other. Being truly in the world, not just living but really being present, makes everything more vivid. When we engage with life fully, we add our own stories to the mix, making the tapestry of life richer and more colorful. Mindfulness turns the normal into the amazing. Paying close attention to the little things, like enjoying a quiet walk or savoring a cup of tea, makes these moments special. It's about finding joy in what might seem ordinary, making them moments of connection and happiness. The stories around us, from people we meet to overheard conversations, show us the many ways life can unfold. These stories remind us of the vast array of experiences out there and our shared human journey. Life stage is set in places where we all come together, like parks, streets, or cafes. These are the spots where the daily show of life is most colorful and full of action. It's where we all come together, each of us adding our own splash of color to the scene. The energy in places full of people is like a dance, moving in waves through the space. Being part of this, feeling connected to everyone else in that moment, is truly special. It's a dance we're all part of, moving together in the rhythm of daily life. But there's also something intriguing about the quiet moments, the ones that might seem too small to notice. These are the times when we often find the biggest surprises, little insights into life and who we are. Life, with all its scenes and moments, shows us how connected we all are. Every little thing we do, every interaction, adds to the story, making life an exciting, vibrant place to be. So, by seeing life as this big, ongoing show, we're invited to look closer, to see the wonder and stories in every day. It's a call to be really here, to notice the beauty and the drama in the normal, and to celebrate this amazing journey we're all on together. By paying attention to the show of daily life, we make our own lives richer and deepen our connections with the world and the people around us. It's about enjoying the play of life and all the little scenes that make it wonderful. 7. The Symphony of Connection Life is like a wonderful song, with each of us playing our own special part in creating a tune that brings us all together. This song of connection is what fills life with color and joy, making a melody that echoes through all the moments we share. At the center of this song are the ways we all get along and interact. Imagine how in music, different notes blend to make a tune. It's the same with us. Every chat, every shared giggle, and even the quiet times we spend together make up the music of our friendships and relationships. The back and forth of talking with others is like the steady beat that keeps the music going. Whether we're diving into deep topics or just chatting about our day, these conversations are the rhythms that keep our connections lively and interesting. Laughter acts like the high notes that lift everyone's spirits. When we share a laugh or a funny moment, it brings us closer, creating memories and bonds that stick with us. It's these times of joy that make our connections light and happy. Then there are the big moments we go through together, adventures, challenges, and celebrations. 
These are the loud, exciting parts of the song that make our relationships stronger and more special. These memories are the highlights of our tune, the parts we'll remember and cherish. But there are also pauses in our song, quiet moments that let us take it all in. These breaks are just as important as the busy times, giving us space to think and feel the importance of being together. It shows us that just being with someone, even in silence, can be really special. Our song of connection is always changing, with every new person we meet and every new experience. It asks us to really be there, to listen and join in. Like being part of a band, we need to tune in to each other, catching the little cues and flowing with the song. Feeling what others feel, or empathy, is the melody that runs through our song, linking us in a deeper way. It's understanding and sharing in what others are going through, both the happy times and the tough ones. This shared feeling is what makes our connections deep and real. Being part of a community, like a chorus, adds to our song too. It's in these groups that we find support, share what we love, and become part of something bigger. It's the harmony that surrounds us, making life fuller and more meaningful. The close, personal bonds we have with some people are the gentle, soothing background music. These deep connections give our song warmth and strength, making us feel safe and loved. Lastly, our song reminds us how great it is to be together. In a world where it's easy to feel alone, coming together in harmony and care makes everything brighter and more beautiful. This song of being together is a celebration of everything that makes us human. The talking, the sharing, the caring, and the feeling of belonging. By enjoying this music of connection, we not only make our own lives richer, but also spread joy and togetherness around us. It's about seeing the beauty in each other and the music we make together, making every day a bit more joyful and full of love. Conclusion We've been on a great adventure together, learning about all the special things that draw people to us, from our kindness to our unique way of being. We've seen how small acts of caring, being ourselves, and sharing laughs can really bring us closer to others. These simple things build bridges between us, making our world a friendlier and more colorful place. By really listening, being there for others, and opening our hearts, we show how everyone can make a difference. This whole journey isn't just about why people might like being around us. It's also a big reminder of how we all have the power to light up someone else's day, whether it's with a smile, a nice word, or just lending an ear. We've got what it takes to spread a little joy. So let's keep all these tips in mind as we go about our days. Let's stay curious, open, and kind, and keep making those connections that not only bring others closer, but also make our lives and theirs a bit brighter. Together, we can fill the world with a bit more light and laughter, one friendly moment at a time. Thanks for coming along on this journey with us. Remember, the real magic of life is all about connecting with others, and every new day is a chance to make those connections stronger. Keep shining your light, sharing your story, and building those bridges. And if this is making sense to you, don't forget to like and subscribe to our Wisdom in Real Life channel.